Urban League is part of the oldest social service provider in the nation. The National Urban League, 101 years old. They help uh, service the community with all kinds of needs. And here to talk with us uh, to tell us about some of the free services they offer is Intermittent. Per, uh, president, rather, CEO, LaVon Lewis. LaVon, thanks for coming in this oh, morning. Oh, thank you for having us. We're just uh, talking about you're a longtime Las Vegan. You've been here 43, 43 years. 43 years. Came here in 1969. Isn't it great? It Isn't it is. great to it's see how the... It's great. It's the, wonderful how the community has grown, but we were also saying we should have bought land. I know, I know. We have... As, <laughs> I was born and raised here, too. We have some regrets, right? Yes, Absolutely. Yes, Let's do. talk about the Urban League. Um, it's relatively new here in it's the Las Vegas Valley. It's relatively new in Las Vegas, right. The Urban League in Las Vegas was chartered in 2004. Okay. Uh, we became an affiliate of the National Urban League. Of course, what you mentioned is the oldest social service organization in the country. And uh, the Urban League, of course, is designed to empower communities and to save lives. I okay. mean, that's really what we do across the nation. And here in Las Vegas, we are a community action agency, uh, and we work to uh, in a number of areas. Uh -huh. For instance, we have recently received a grant to work with homeless veterans. Oh, that's great. So, that's so needed right now, yeah, too. So needed, yeah. so needed. So we provide uh, services that get veterans from being homeless okay. into housing. That's our primary goal with that program. With any service, how does this work with um, the Urban League? Do you have to join, or can you just walk in and say, hey, I no, need some help? No, you don't or, have to okay. join. You ha just walk in and say, we need okay. some help. We try to uh, get people then in to see what kind of help uh, do they need. We have a family development department and that department works with people to uh, to remove the barriers that okay. keep them from being able to move to sustainability. Yeah. You know, we do things like get them uh, a driver's license. We get them uh, identification so that they can get a driver's license. A lot of these simple things simple that, that things. people do need help with and you also help with language like learning we, languages if people come yeah, we refer them okay. uh, for for help with okay. uh, you know English as a second language, yeah. uh, and we refer them to other uh, places where they actually do that. But we also help people to find jobs, and Which is that's huge, a big important. thing. Our yeah. family development department works to help people find jobs. Uh -huh. uh, we give them training, uh, you know, employability skills yeah. that they need to go out and find a job. We have we operate 31 public computer centers through a grant from the Department of Commerce and that was our funding that's going to go away so I don't know what's going to happen oh, no. to all of those centers okay. if we don't find some community support okay. to keep them open we have 20 in uh, housing uh, regional housing authority facilities and eight that are in city okay. uh, facilities so if you can help out the, if you need more information here's the number for maybe donations, we you are. always we are need always volunteers. We are always looking for donations. Okay. We look for volunteers, uh, and and we certainly need uh, donations yeah. for the Urban League. You and know? of course, if you need help, the Urban League will step up. We and, will step right up. We have a reintegration of ex-offender program, uh -huh. so we're working to get ex-offenders reintegrated into the community and to reduce the recidivism rate. Yeah. We have a, a number of programs. And That's so just a, many services that are, are needed right. now because of the economy, about troubles people are we're having right now. Oh, yeah, so. we're seeing people that we never thought we would yeah. have seen, you know, uh, three or four years ago. Well, thank goodness yeah. you guys are here. LaVon, thank you for coming in. Thank you so much for having me. Right, I we'll really have, appreciate we'll it. We'll have all that information on the website, too. Hopefully, we can get those uh, computer centers uh, and keep them open. Thank you. Thank, thank you. you. We, we appreciate that. All right. Jason. All right. Thanks, guys. Well,